What's up, YouTube? It's your white looking Native American friend Tyrone. So, today we got a quick video for you, um, for you Fortnite players, or for anyone that I guess needs to uh, change their display resolution or their display size. So, a lot of people, you know, including Myth, Tifu, um, I'm seeing switch to this stretch type gameplay, and a lot of them are running 1440 by 1080. So, I figured. You know, I wanted to try it for myself, and now I figure, I think that maybe some people will want to know how to do this too, so hopefully this helps you guys. So the first thing you're going to do, you're going to come down to the NVIDIA control panel, you're going to open it up, and then we're going to go down to adjust desktop size and position. Once you're there, we're going to click full screen, and then we're going to click that checkbox where you override the scaling mode set by games and programs. That way Fortnite doesn't override it, or, you know, whatever game you're trying to play doesn't override your, your settings. So next we're gonna to go to change resolution. Um, as you can see, I already have the 1440 there, but we're gonna click uh, customize, or you guys will. Uh, once you do that, you'll be able to see create custom resolution. You'll click that, you'll change your um, horizontal resolution by uh, 1440, that's what I did, um, or whatever one you wanna use. Um, and then you change your refresh rate. So I'm using a 144 Hertz monitor. So that's what I changed mine to. Once you do that, you'll click test and then you'll be able to save your custom resolution and then you'll click on it and click apply. So once you do that, you'll see that, that you are now stretched, but now we need to make sure we get the same resolution to run in Fortnite since it's not a preset resolution in Fortnite as you may have or may not have noticed. So you're gonna come down here to the search bar, type in percent app data and percent again, and you'll see that a file pops up. So we'll open that. Once you're here, you'll see the app data is up top. So we're gonna click that. We're gonna click on local. We're gonna find Fortnite game. We're gonna open that. We're gonna click saved. We're gonna go to config, Windows client, game user settings. And then once we're here, we're gonna change the resolution size for a couple of settings. So we'll change that to whatever custom resolution size that, that you wanted. I wanted 1440, so I'm changing mine from 1920 to 1440. So you'll see that there's another 1440. Um, and so I've, oh, I've, I've done this a couple times just to test it out a few different times. And sometimes I've seen two of the resolution sizes pop up, but sometimes there's four, like in this case, there's four. So just change those. And then once you change those, there should be no more than four. You click file, save, and then you can just exit out and you should be good to go from there. So we'll open up Fortnite for you guys just to show you that it worked. Um, but yeah, that's it. Just a quick video for you guys. Um, if you liked what you see, please make sure to leave a like on the video. It really helps out the channel, really helps us grow. If you have any constructive feedback um, or constructive criticism, that's always great too. I love to know what, I'm, what I need to do better to improve the channel. Make sure to comment too if you guys just want to chat or, or whatnot. And then be sure to look in the description. You'll, you'll find my Twitter links. You'll find... Instagram, you'll find uh, the link to the Discord, my gamer tag, all the, all that stuff, all that important information is down in the description. So make sure you follow the Twitter, especially because you'll be able to see when I'm going to go live um, with a live stream or when I decide to upload a new video, or it's basically just the best way for us to interact besides when, when I do a live stream. So that's going to be it for this video. Um, as you can see right now, we're kind of with a sporadic schedule. I'm going to try and stick to at least one upload a week. If we do better than that, that's great. Um, but I'm going to try and at least do one video a week for you guys. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and we'll see you guys next time.